हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू दी फर्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ ट्रिकोपीडिया यस लेट्स ट्रिक इट सो एज वी हैव बीन टेलिंग यू दैट ऑन योर फेवरेट बाई जूज एग्जाम प्रेप यूट्यूब चैनल वी आर ब्रिंगिंग यू द ट्रिकोपीडिया एंड दैट इज गोइंग टू गिव यू द शॉर्टकट द ट्रिक्स अप्रोचेस फॉर मल्टीपल कॉन्सेप्ट ओके सो इट्स नॉट अ कॉन्सेप्चुअल वीडियो वी कीप लर्निंग अबाउट द कॉन्सेप्ट लाइक यू नो वी हैव बीन फ्लोटिंग आई गन वैल्यू वॉट द कॉन्सेप्ट इज ओके वेर दे आर यूजफुल वॉट इज द प्रॉपर्टीज एंड ऑल बट इन दिस स्मॉल वीडियो आई विल डेमोस्ट्रेट यू हाउ टू क्विकली कैलकुलेट आई गन वैल्यूज ऑफ अ थ्री क्रॉस three matrix because at this point of time many students spend a time in calculating the characteristic equation and then finding the eigen value so let's get started quickly guys okay this trichopedia video right so the number one thing is okay we are all knowing that what is the characteristic equation of a matrix the characteristic equation of a matrix is given by modulus of a minus lambda i equal to 0 okay and we know about this okay what is characteristic equation from where does it come okay abhi keval technique ki baat karenge and when we solve this characteristic equation the roots of that characteristic equation are the eigen values we know now how do you normally solve it let's generally take the 3 cross 3 matrix Okay, because I'm telling you the intent of this video is about a three cross three matrix. So if I have a three cross three matrix with the given elements, what is the characteristic equation? Okay, so first of all, what you're going to do? Modulus of a minus lambda i equal to zero. That's what normally you are going to do. Okay, so the characteristic equation after taking the determinant of a minus lambda i turns out to be this. Now, what normally students will do? They'll find the determinant. then find the equation and try to solve the roots of the equation every time you're going to solve the determinant okay it should be a determinant actually not the matrix okay but every time if you solve the determinant it's going to be a little bit time consuming let's have a direct look into the characteristic equation so on solving this is what is the method okay that i'm going to give you in this particular video lambda q minus beta 1 lambda square plus beta 2 lambda minus beta 3 equal to 0 directly put down the beta 1 beta 2 beta 3 you get the equation directly without solving determinant beta 1 will be the trace of the matrix that is sum of diagonal elements okay a11 plus a22 plus a33 so the beta 2 is the sum of the minors of the diagonal elements okay so the matrix was what a11 a12 a13 a21 a22 a23 the original matrix i'm telling a31 a32 a33 right this was the matrix okay so beta 2 is sum of the minors oh i'm so sorry sum of the minors of the diagonal elements okay so if this is a diagonal element what will be the minor okay delete the row and column you get 2 2 2 3 3 2 3 which is written here okay similarly this is the diagonal element you delete the row and column you get the a11 a13 a31 and 33 okay which is written here and similarly the third one the beta 3 factor is known as the determinant and we all know how to calculate the very simple determinant of the matrix okay let's quickly apply to this on the problem okay theek okay. hai and now and we know that uh, right now virtual calculators are allowed in gate and in virtual calculators you don't have cubic equations so accordingly i will tell you the questions so guys quickly you can compute beta 1 beta 2 beta 3 sum of the diagonal elements 1 8 minus 3 becomes 6 okay the sum of the minors like this is one of the minors so 8 minus 8 this is going to be next minus 24 and uh, minus 12 and then this is next okay ye wala to minus 3 minus 6 sum of the minors of every diagonal element this is minus 45 determinant you expand about any row first row or any of the row okay you get the determinant zero and not only this if you just see na if you just see first plus third row is equal to second row first plus third row is equal to second row okay and that means the determinant must be zero because whenever rows are dependent to each other okay whenever rows are similar or dependent determinant will be zero the determinant zero aaya is equation mein put kiya so because of the determinant factor equal to zero this actually becomes a okay the quadratic is now converted into a factor lambda into quadratic the cubic is converted to quadratic and then we can solve for the roots of quadratic one of the eigen value is zero after applying the formula for quadratic equation and solving we get this eigen value aa gaya bahut easily aa gaya ek aur dekhte quickly very very quickly okay so it may not be necessary that determinant is always zero so given a matrix 0 1 1 1 0 1 1 1 0 i have the beta 1 beta 2 beta 3 written in front of me okay you can compute these values i have told you what does this mean when i substitute i get the equation only beta 1 is zero the trace is zero for the matrix okay but beta 2 and beta 3 have some non zero value and that is why it is a perfect cubic equation now you might be telling sir there is no virtual calculator no scientific calculator trust me guys if iit is making the paper they know that they have not given you scientific calculator with cubic equation so if such a question come it will be in such a equation that it can be factorized thoda sa effort dal sakte right so you can break it into lambda and 2 lambda just break this into lambda and 2 lambda okay and now from here if i take two common here i take lambda common lambda into lambda square minus 1 minus 2 of lambda plus 1 lambda square minus 1 is lambda minus 1 lambda plus 1 so lambda plus 1 i have taken common okay so the inner term becomes quadratic 
quadratic again you can solve by the formula or you can factorize ultimately you get lambda plus 1 lambda plus 1 lambda minus 2 equal to 0 so lambda is minus 1 and minus 1 and plus 2 these are the three eigenvalues now there are several important properties also onto which question can be solved i'll bring you that also in small small videos but this the intent of this video was give you right give without applying any property yes there will be several questions with property but suppose you don't have any property or you don't have any options you have an nat question or you have somewhere you require to find all eigenvalues by the method okay rather than finding determinant a minus lambda equal to 0 we can directly find this thank you so subscribe to the channel if you are liking it because daily you are going to get trichopedia to trick the gate examination hope each and every approach each and every technique is going to give you a boost in the gate examination thank you stay safe take care of yourself